let's talk about Vader. We have to. It's the elephant in the room. Uh, no pun intended. Uh, but talk about Vader. He obviously was outspoken. That's been talked about to death. Uh, it all culminated with a bout with Vader. Uh, you can go as in depth as you want up on this. Uh, How in depth you want me to go? Hey, look. You can say what you want about it. Obviously, uh, Vader and you had a clash, a uh, social media battle, if you will. Vader took it to social media. He, he chastised the bout with Ricochet. He called it flippy do and gymnastics, not like things were Great his out, day, yeah. etc. So then you got very, uh, you got combated back, which I loved because I think young people have to be proud of what they do. And and uh, to me, it was not disrespectful. That, it was just that was the one thing that annoyed me. Everyone was like, "You need to show respect to Vader." I was like, "What have I said? That was said bad. Nothing. Like I said nothing wrong. I'm being fucking bullied by this cunt." Like, <laughs> and I, I use that word very, very strongly against him. <laughs> yes, like, uh, and after I tell you the story, everyone will happily go with me on this. Mm -hmm. So obviously. When it came out, it was like, oh, it's gymnasts, don't know what they're doing. I was like, oh, cheers for the share, mate. I didn't think nothing of it, like, cheers for sharing the video clip. And then it was just, and then just, it kept coming, like, some of the things, like, that was the one that really upset me. He said, me and Anoki done more for New Japan in one match than Will Ospreay and Ricochet will ever do in their entire career. And I I was so offended by that. So I just, I was like, fuck this, I'm blocking you. Like, I'm just, mm -hmm. I'm done with you, you fucking reject. So, like, so. And I think that's the thing that made me laugh is because he was so unhappy about how wrestling was these days, and it's it's just changed. Deal with it. It's how I express my art form. Mm -hmm. So please just shut the fuck up and leave me alone. <laughs> but then fans would keep tweeting me like saying, "Oh, Vader's calling you out. You could do anything about it." I was like, "What?" So I had to unblock him to yeah. find out what the fuck he was saying. He was generally calling me out, like trying to like. So I was like, "Mate," and he was like saying, "Oh, I'm gonna fuck Osprey up shoot style." I was like, Jesus Christ, what the fuck is this guy's problem? Is it because I've done a Vader bomb? Like, it's like yeah. I've done it on New Japan, obviously, and like, I let him kick out one. Yeah, you did playful little things. It but was like, nothing, nothing like yeah. bullying. Yeah, like, he yeah. was legit bullying me, like, yeah. online. Show you, wait, I remember Vader as this badass motherfucker who can, like, mm -hmm. probably kill people. Well, I'm glad that I'm going to put this little thing on everyone's lips because now, hopefully, people will know this is the Vader. So, the moment... <laughs> The moment he was like, "Will email me. We've got to talk." I thought generally he was like, "We we we're, we're gonna fucking have it out, like, like as fucking men." Like, do you know what I mean? He was like, "I've got no problem with you. I want to do a match. I think we can sell this place out. Yada yada yada. What do you think?" I was like, "Cool. Yeah, let's do it." I ain't got, I because he written this long ass message. I was like, "Yeah, cool. Let's do it." Mm -hmm. And then uh, like, how in depth are we allowed to go with this? Am I allowed to like? pulled the curtain back really, really far. Hey, like, go for it, dude. So, <laughs> I'm at it. 